tones for today's Cisco. Today will be our special suit, Super Bowl themed episode on High Five. We'll get you set for the big game in a vote two new consensus are for a Battle for Things competition. Commercials are a huge part of the Super Bowl experience. This year, advisors will pay about $6.5 million for a 30-second spot. You can catch the game on NBC. Not to be outdone, the Super Bowl halftime show has become a huge spectacle as well. This year's 1990s hip-hop stars Dr. Dre, Snoop Dogg, Eminem, and Mary J. Blige will join Kendrick Lamar in Los Angeles. You can't have a Super Bowl party without spoon. American schools consume about $1 billion chicken wings on Super Bowl Sunday. With that, let's get into the game. Super Bowl 56 will feature the Los Angeles Rams playing in their own stadium against the Cincinnati Bengals. LKTV caught up with some of our LMS students to get their thoughts about the big game. Yeah, I think the Bengals will win. I think they have a good chance. Don't surprising that Ohio team is in the Super Bowl. Absolutely not. Uh, wait, are you going to watch the Super Bowl? Absolutely not. Okay. It's a mix. The new Doritos commercials. Um, food. <laughs> I guess we'll see if they are right as we head into the fourth quarter on this edition of High Five. Let's update our Battle of Random Things competition. Here are last week's results. Today is a special football theme edition of Battle of Random Things. Try to be best, cause you're only a man, and a man's got to learn to take it. Try to believe. Let's get into the Battle of Random Things competition. Challenger 1, Joe Burrow. Joe Burrow played for Ohio State University through 2015 to 2017, but he then transferred to Louisiana State University and played there during 2018 and 2020. He won them a national championship. He also grew up in the plains of Ohio and was the first overall number one draft pick in the NFL. In his first full NFL season, he led his entire his team, team, the Cincinnati Bengals, to the Super Bowl. Challenger number two, Bruno from Encanto. Power, precognition, the ability to see the future. Likes his family, rats, theatrical arts, and hourglasses. One of the three fraternal triplets, Alma and Pedro, Madrigal had. He is Ma Mirabel's maternal uncle whose gift is the ability to see the future. Joe Bruno versus Bruno from Encanto is a matchup for their ages. The fact is it's in your hands, LMS. Remember to vote in your classifier page. We're looking for our LKD form. The results will be shared next week. That brings today's episode to a close. As always, if you have stories you feel belong on High Five, please contact Mr. Cronster. Also, please check us out on YouTube. Our channel is Student Videos Lakeview Local Ohio. I'll get TV has its own playlist called Middle School Video Production Class. Until next time, stay safe, LMS. Enjoy the game.